No, it's not you. You're not going crazy. This is happening to so many more people. Even I myself experienced this when I tried using the keyboard on my brother's iPhone 16 Pro after updating to iOS 26. But yeah, plenty of users are experiencing a keyboard issues when typing certain letters or words and their iPhone is just giving out the wrong letters and words. And yes, this mostly could happen because of the fact that iOS 26 26 introduces the system wide interface, the liquid gloss design, the new UI, and this can have an impact on the keyboard. And the YouTuber Michi Nikomichi actually demonstrated this bug really, really well. I think what was really shocking was the fact that so many people were responding to this video and also telling that they had the same problem. I at first didn't think so many people had this issue, but then I just saw the response and all the bugs that people were facing. And it's just crazy how he's able to capture the bug in slow motion. You really see that he's typing a U and then a totally different letter is popping up. And what shocks me is that he is able to reproduce this bug over and over. So iOS is really not learning from the mistakes that are being made. This is without a doubt a system wide bug. So what's crazy is that I not so long ago was using my brother's iPhone to send a message and I just told him like, like your keyboard sucks so much. I'm typing these words and when I normally would do that on my iPhone 17 Pro Max I wouldn't have any problems but typing on his device was an absolute nightmare so yes I even experienced this for myself but after updating and doing some changes we are not facing any issues with his iPhone anymore I'm going to share some fixes at the end but first I also would like to cover that Michi Nico Michi also demonstrated that autocorrect on or off doesn't change the bug nor touch target prediction so yes I can imagine that this is extremely annoying for many people and there are some fixes that I found online I did some research for some people some weird things actually help them to fix the keyboard issues that they were facing with their iPhones obviously I know like a simple restart is not going to help you because you probably already did but there are some other fixes that I'd like to share with you right now okay so first of all let me show you how my iPhone settings the keyboard settings look so right now I'm running the latest version of iPhone iOS. Um, if we go to about, you can see 26.0.1. And if we go to our keyboard settings in here as well, these are actually my keyboard settings and I'm not facing this issue. So if you want to duplicate them, that's totally fine. I have an English and Dutch keyboard installed as well as an English and French keyboard. And again, I'm not facing any problems. But say you have the same settings and are still experiencing these keyboard problems, there are some fixes. So in here, one of the fixes that I've read that worked is to toggle off a slide to type. So yeah, just try that and see if that fixes your issue. Next up, if you go to the top in keyboards, deleting and reinstalling the different language keyboards you have could also potentially fix the issues. Then two very interesting ones not in keyboards. If we go to our settings again, then go to accessibility. In accessibility, go to display and text size and if you toggle on reduce transparency for some users this actually fixed the bug as well and weirdly enough another one is that when you go to uh, display and uh, brightness right there and then toggle on light mode so toggle off dark mode for some users this also provided a fix to this bug now there are also some more like severe things you could do which I highly recommend you not to do but if you really want this keyboard to get fixed there are some things you could do obviously you could completely reset your iPhone but I'm not talking about that one yet that really in my opinion is a lost solution so one of the solutions is to go into general scroll all the way to the bottom and then transfer or reset iPhone and then if you click on reset you have the possibility to reset your keyboard dictionary if you do this all the words that your iPhone remembered about the words you prefer to use your auto suggestion everything will be reset and erased to zero. So yes, this is actually a pretty drastic measure that I highly recommend you not to do. So yeah, actually the best thing we can do is to wait for Apple to release a software update um, and make them aware of this issue because this is just a bug inside of iOS and should be fixed with a simple software update. All right guys, so yeah, I hope this was helpful. Make sure to subscribe, hit the bell icon, like this video and see you in the next one. Peace.